this video, we will show you four case studies carried out by the IPA team members Imtel Lab, Etma Lab, Arcto and FAU. Our IPA partner Imtel Lab developed an AR application that offers a peer-to-peer -peer setting in the field of neuroscience and covers the digital representation of brain structures. Its name is NeuroLens. The NeuroLens application is developed for HoloLens 2. It enables visualizing and manipulating a digital red brain generated from MRI scans collaboratively. Then the brain structure can be separated into relevant anatomical units. A shared view of what the HoloLens user sees allows other students to follow either in the same physical space or remotely. While HoloLens users interact with the digital brain and manipulate it, their peers can see the manipulation's consequences in real time and respond to them. The students without the HoloLens use an Android device to join the collaborative session. Both HoloLens 2 and Android users can manipulate the holographic brain. In addition, Microsoft introduced the Windows device portal to stream the app to a monitor. This shared AR space enables several individuals, collocated or remote, to participate in a session. One lecturer or student can explain to classmates the topic at hand. And since participants have a shared view, students can explain to each other, manipulate brain parts and show relevant points. In addition to the Android version, an iOS version of NevroLens is under development. Another app, Pelvis Lens, featuring pelvis anatomy, is developed using the same technology. Several other anatomical units and regions are planned. The second case study used the AR Tutor platform, which is one of the eight tools included in the IPA toolkit. AR Tutor is the only platform that is developed especially for educational purposes and it is the only one that you can use completely free of charge. AR Tutor is developed by our IPA partner Aetma Lab. It is open to educators who have no coding skills. With AR Tutor, you can add digital content on top of printed or electronic material. All types of augmentations are fully interactable and you can use touch gestures to play with the augmentations. Additionally, AR Tutor supports location-based AR. This means that experiences can be triggered in specific locations. Moreover, multiple users can edit the same AR experience collaboratively. AR Tutor is used in the Imtech for Ed hackathons, where students work collaboratively towards the development of specific educational projects. On these occasions, students developed several AR experiences with the help of AR Tutor, like Local History Game and Accordo di Musica. The third case was carried out by our IP partner Acto Arts and Design College and took place in a graphic arts and multimedia class. Students added images, audio files, videos, animation or 3D objects on advertising labels they had developed before. As a learning outcome, students had to tell a story around the advertised products. Additionally, they could scan a printed image on their devices and augment it with information about their project. Students' activities were carried out with the IR tools 3D Bear and Vidinotti AR. Another case took place in a media science class at our IP partner Friedrich Alexander Universität Erlangen Nürnberg. Students had to develop an e-learning module collaboratively. One group chose to work with AR to demonstrate the efficiency of a specific sociological theory on mass media. The group used Metaverse to create the AR experience. <laughs> 